We're gonna do some self-care tonight. My mascara just looks so much better. Hey girlies, welcome back to my channel. I feel like ever since I went down to one video a week, I feel like I never filmed. I honestly didn't even know if I would like have the time to even film this video because it's exam time. Today is Saturday. This upcoming week is the last week of classes. It's not even a full week. I think Wednesday is the last day of classes. Typically exam week isn't that stressful for me just because all I'm doing is like studying or waiting around to present a project or something so anyway none of this has anything to do with this video i am gonna do a night routine tonight because it has been just a dreary day i will show you guys in a second what outside looks like but it's literally just fog like i can't see anything out of my window so i really haven't done anything i went to wendy's with micah for lunch i came back here did some homework. I finished New Girl for like the millionth time. So it's now 7.07, .07, so it's time for dinner. But yeah, also, do you see my... I recently bought some things off of Amazon and one of them is like these LED light bulbs. This video is not sponsored by anyone. We are gonna go eat some dinner. I think I'm gonna have a rice bowl. I also think we're gonna do some self-care tonight. If you've been subscribed for a while, you know that I've used like the same products on my face since like middle school and I at the same time always talk about how dry my skin is and so I just got fed up and finally switched it up. So stay tuned for that. It's not like completely different but but there are some things that I've been doing differently. We'll get into that later. It's literally, can't see a thing. You can kind of see like the buildings and stuff, but other than that, it's just completely white. When I was doing my homework and stuff, I just got this speaker. This is one of the things I got from Amazon. Anchor speaker. I just chose one that looked nice because I don't have a speaker. Every time I like play music in my room, it's either from my phone or my laptop or I cast it to my TV. And I just really wanted a speaker, so I finally got one. And it's so nice. I was like really in the zone, just feeling so calm doing my homework. Anyway, I'm starving, so let's go eat. Okay, I turned on my light. I wanted to show you guys my dinner. I already mixed it up, so it's not as pretty anymore, but it's just rice, chicken, spinach, corn, and this like lemon dressing. And then this is one of the things that I recently got from Amazon. I've recently been making ice green tea a lot and I didn't really want to put it in regular cups anymore and it didn't feel right going into my Yeti. So I decided to get this. It was only like $10. It is glass. It's like BPA free, good for the environment. The straw is silicone. This thing is silicone. This sounds like it's sponsored, <laughs> but it's not. I I just really like it and I only just got it but I already feel like I can't stop using it. It's very much my vibe. So anyway, <laughs> sorry. I'm about to start the show Ginny and Georgia. I've heard it's good. We're gonna try it out. Oh my gosh, the first episode is an hour long. I mean, I guess that's fine, whatever. Also, wow, my poor food is getting cold but I'm trying to decide what color I want. This is the little remote that comes with the LED light bulb. So there's a bunch of different colors, a bunch of different settings. Right now it's on purple. This is the yellow, there's a pink teal like there's a bunch but i kind of really like the purple anyway my food's getting cold i'm gonna watch my show Okay, I finished eating and I finished the first episode of Ginny and Georgia. It's really good so far. It's <laughs> kind of it's kind of crazy. I thought it was gonna be like this cute little feel good show. No drama, but I mean first episode, and I'm like. 
Anyway, I will probably continue watching that tonight because it's only around 8.30 right now. It's 8.25, but I really want to shower. Like I said, it's been a calm day, so we're going to do some self-care. This will probably be a little montage slash voiceover moment. Enjoy. So while I was in the shower, I used the Clean and Clear Night Relaxing Face Wash and this Botanical Benefits Body Scrub and it made my skin feel so good. To tone and prep my face, I just used some witch hazel. Then I used this Neutrogena Hydro Boost Mask. This was my second time using it. I had a little trouble opening it. <laughs> Whipped out the scissors. I guess I forgot how to be it's kind of a messy process putting it on and it's a little bit tricky, but once you get it and you smooth it all out, it feels really, really good on your face. I also decided to use my Nova Shine Teeth Whitening Kit for a little bit of extra self-care, but I did forget to brush my teeth or rinse my mouth before using it, but it's fine. I set my timer for 15 minutes to let my mask sit and the Nova Shine, and I watched a little bit of my show while I was waiting. After the timer went off, I went ahead and rubbed in the residue from the mask. Don't forget about the neck. Then I've been using the CeraVe moisturizer with SPF in it, which is really nice since it's been getting warmer. I used to use the Aveeno one and I finally decided I needed to switch it up. And I really, really love how this one makes my skin feel, it makes my skin so moisturized and hydrated. And I've had very minimal flakiness, which is really, really nice. And I think that the longer I use it, the better it will get. Then you can't forget chapstick. Okay, just finished up with my skincare. I haven't brushed my teeth yet because I have a feeling I'm gonna want like a snack later, so I'll probably end up brushing my teeth a little bit later. But yeah, that is my updated skincare. I, as you guys know, I used to use the Aveeno moisturizer forever and ever and ever, and because of the acne medication that I use, I didn't use it tonight just because I don't use it every day because it dries out my face. But because of that, I needed to switch my moisturizer. I was scared of doing it because I get scared of like breaking out and stuff when I use new products, but it just got to the point where I had like flaky skin all the time and I just hated it. So I finally worked up the courage to switch my moisturizer and also start implementing toner. I used to use witch hazel as toner all the time and then I just got lazy. I know that toner is not like a super necessary thing, I just wanted to try it out and see what it did for my skin. So it was the toner, the moisturizer, and a Neutrogena like hydrating mask. And it's a little messy and difficult to put on, <laughs> but it feels really, really good. And when it's on, it's like gives this cooling feeling. So I love it. One of them was two or three dollars at Walmart. You can even tell like my skin looks hydrated. I love it. So I'll probably start doing it like once or twice a week just to give my face a little extra extra hydration and moisture. That body scrub is new. That was the first time I had used it and it smelled so good and my skin, I wanted to try it out and I really, really liked it. I just over time realized that my skin doesn't really like simple and it needs a little bit extra, which kind of sucks, but like my skin feels a lot better than it has in a while. So that's my spiel. I'm still watching Ginny and Georgia. Got my little lamp on. There is like a setting where it changes colors gradually. Yeah. It's like a subtle change. Anyway, it's only 9.30 right now, so I'll probably just keep watching Ginny and Georgia. I'm kind of done with like homework for the day. I try not to do homework on Saturdays anyway. Probably just gonna relax, keep watching this show, but I might get a snack later. So we're gonna just relax. One, two. 
organic coconut oil on my eyelashes with this little spoolie thing. I just wanted to say that real quick. It was of course super loud in the bathroom, but basically the reason I've been putting coconut oil on my eyelashes and eyebrows, no reason really for my eyebrows, but I have noticed that my whole face used to be dry, I've said that, and I would notice it even when I would like fill in my eyebrows when I was doing my makeup, and I've noticed that since putting coconut oil on them, that doesn't happen anymore, like they're not dry. For my eyelashes, I wanted to see if the coconut oil would help my eyelashes grow. I haven't really noticed anything, but I have noticed that my mascara looks a lot better. I haven't been doing it for that long, but I have noticed a difference. Maybe not so much in length, but more in like quality of my eyelashes and just like my mascara just looks so much better that's enough for me also i realized that i said earlier that i was using this for iced green tea but i haven't had that today i've just been drinking water out of it all right that is going to be it for my night routine. It is now 11.33. It's not even really that late, especially for a Saturday night. <laughs> but I probably won't go right to sleep. I'll probably be on my phone for a little bit. Also, I will go ahead and link everything in this video down below. Like I said, not sponsored. I did recently become like an Amazon affiliate. I'm still trying to figure out how it works. Most of the stuff is already from Amazon, so those will be Amazon links, but the skincare products, I don't know. I might try to find them on Amazon. And the way it works is like, if you use the link, that I provide like the Amazon link then I get like a little percentage of it it doesn't cost you any extra so that's nice for you but I just thought I would put that out there I haven't actually like had anyone use any of my links because I haven't mentioned it at all so I'll link stuff in the description we'll see if it works and yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this video my hair looks crazy if you did enjoy this video don't forget to like it subscribe do all of the things get me I used to do this I think at the end of every video when I first started YouTube and I haven't done it in a while but I would like set little goals for myself subscriber wise so I'm gonna start doing that again I think I'm like three subscribers away from 1300 so I'll say get me to 1400 can you do it? If you're watching this and you're not subscribed, please do. It means the world to me. And that's, that's gonna be it. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. <laughs> um. Okay, is this blurry or? Third, um.